Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you are a nurse or midwife aspiring to practice in the UK, it is essential to be registered with the Nursing and Midwifery uh, Council, you know, NMC. A key requirement for this registration is the demonstration of English language proficiency, which is a critical factor for many individuals uh, seeking to work as nurses in the UK. In today's video, I will outline three specific circumstances under which you may not need to provide evidence of uh, achieving a score of 7 in IELTS or OET examinations, yet still qualify for registration with the NMC and pursue a nursing career in the UK. The initial pathway, the first pathway to register as a nurse in the uh, UK with the Nursing and Midwifery Council without taking the Occupational English uh, Test OET is, uh, is to have completed your training in the UK. It is essential to note that not all educational institutions or courses in the UK are recognized by the NMC. Therefore, it is crucial to verify that the institution you attended is approved as any international candidates invest significant resources into programs that ultimately do not lead to NMC registration. I encourage you to leave a comment below indicating the country from which you are viewing this video. To reiterate, the first requirement is that your training must have been conducted in the UK at an NMC approved institution. This presents a significant opportunity, particularly for some international candidates, as the process can often be more time consuming for them. An alternative option is that if you have trained in English outside of the UK, specifically in a recognized majority English speaking country, this presents a significant opportunity. Training in such a country allows you to register with the NMC in the UK without the need for an English language test, provided you meet certain criteria. Even if you have taken the test and did not achieve the required score, you may still qualify under this pathway. However, it is important to note that they are understand the requirements. Many individuals find the abundance of information on platforms like uh, YouTube to be overwhelming. Therefore, I recommended that after viewing this video, you must visit the NMC website and dedicate some time to reviewing the guidelines. Since I am unaware of your unique circumstances, I encourage you to share the country where you complete, I mean, where you completed your nursing studies in the comments. This will enable me to inform you whether it qualifies as a recognized majority, you know, recognized majority English speaking country. This pathway is particularly suitable for those who have studied in such countries. Additionally, it is worth nothing that this process is especially beneficial for individuals already residing in the UK. There are numerous overseas trained nurses currently employed as carers in the UK who are eligible for this pathway. As this transition may take some time, if you are currently employed in the UK, you may pursue this pathway. It requires a considerable amount of time and involves several steps. However, it is particularly suitable for individuals in your situation. Therefore, it is important to consider your personal circumstances. If you know anyone who could benefit from this information, this information, please share it with them, as many remain unaware of the available pathway. Even if you received your training outside the UK, you can still work as a nurse in the UK and join the NMC register without needing to take the IELTS or OET. So pathway number three applies to those who have trained in English in a predominantly English speaking country, albeit not in the UK. The pathways can be intricate. So it is essential to determine which one aligns best with your situation. Notably, only 30 countries worldwide are eligible for pathway number three, which is why I encourage you to leave a comment below indicating your country of origin. As only these 30 countries are recognized by the NMC for this pathway as of today. If you have completed your training outside of the UK in any of specified countries, you are eligible to register as a nurse in the UK without the need of an OET examination. You simply need to approach the Nursing and Midwifery Council and express your intention to work in the UK as a nurse, midwife or nursing associate. These are the three roles regulated by the NMC, which will facilitate your registration to practice in the UK without requiring an OAT. However, it is crucial to understand that information is vital. You must be aware of specific pathways for which you qualify as not all the pathways will be applicable to you. There will be one pathway that is more suitable for you, your situation. If you find that you do not qualify for any of these pathways, it does not imply that you cannot work as a nurse in the UK. 
you can also follow my uh, TikTok channel. You can also follow my uh, WhatsApp channel where I'm all, uh, already posting the uh, sponsorship jobs. You must need to go there and on daily basis, you can check the sponsorship jobs as well. So guys, this is the, all the video for today. I hope this information will help you and uh, will understand uh, the need of the IELTS or English language test. So thank you so much for watching this video. See you in the next video.